Welcome, folks. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for the latest presentation of our NBA basketball. We'll see Los Angeles facing Anaheim. So Anaheim will get the first possession. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. They've got O'Neal. Bird is up there with Abdul-Jabbar. Then it's Magic Johnson. And it's Jordan in a, the two-guard spot. No good from Ewing. Johnson kicks to Bird. Paul George with the steal. Right side out of the Kumbo. Butler against Jordan. It's stolen by Abdul Jabbar. Jordan dishes to Johnson. Bird, the pass to O'Neal. And Ewing sends it back. Here's the hook. Outside for Jordan. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Wall. That's his first foul. And just about a minute into the first quarter. Here's Bird. Goes up again. Wall with some nice D. Los Angeles on D. Hangs on the trifecta. Butler's got his first three points of the game. How on earth did they let him get that wide open? And here's Bird for three. Good on the three-point shot. Only took him a few seconds to answer the three ball with one of their own. Greg, we've got a three-point battle taking shape here. Now, here's Wall. From the arc. Rebounded by Abdul-Jabbar. Boy, even though he missed, you can't give up that kind of a look very often. But better to be lucky than good sometimes. Fortunately, they didn't get burned on that one. Yeah, perfect release that time. I mean, I thought it might get blocked, but no. Yeah, he was giving up a lot of size in that particular matchup, but showed the excellent ability to get off that shot despite the disadvantage in size. You know, his ability is matched only by his energy, guys. I mean, he's usually in the middle of everything for his team. Oh, that is just weak defense there. I'm pretty sure that was not the plan to give him those kind of baskets at the hoop. Well, I tell you, that's, that, that really sets a bad tone, especially this early. I mean, I'd rather see him commit a hard foul than give him an easy two like that. Show that you're willing to protect the basket. Make him earn it, at least. Now, here is Abdul-Jabbar following the miss by John Wall. Again, Los Angeles. It might be the most difficult shot in basketball, the hook shot. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Butler. And it's a completely new group for Los Angeles. Los Angeles leading by five. This offense has really been clicking. And they know it, guys. They're playing right now with the kind of energy that is hard to deal with. A great assist. Nice work from Russell Westbrook. And another miss by Anaheim. He feeds it to Wade. Here's Weber. And Weber throws it down. This is crazy. Every shot they're taking right now is finding the mark. Literally every shot, partner. I mean, they just aren't missing. To stop the run. And Patrick Ewing with the slam. Forget about finesse and agility. This big fella's all about power and force. Westbrook kicks to Weber. Good. Nice assist from Westbrook. Moving it around. Eight of their last ten coming off assists. And Greg, you know nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. He 
he can be a weapon if he gets going early from long range. I agree because it's all about confidence with him. That first one goes and he gets into a groove and a rhythm. His mind is right and tight. At that point, you know you're going to have trouble in a good game for him. See, he operates well in traffic, but still, that's just a tough play to finish. And sometimes he can hit that deep three, but it's not a high percentage shot for him. Yeah, even for him, that's out of his range. Here's Ewing. And count it. Two points with a chance for one more at the free throw line. And just a nice combination of size and feel there. Terrific finish down low. Marcus Gasol's checked in for Anaheim. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. James Worthy's checked in for Weber. Defender a little hesitant to offer resistance as he bursts to the hoop. James. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. No one near him. Out to Wade. Poke loose. Launches it. Oh, my God. The first quarter concludes in a double-digit lead on the scoreboard. Los Angeles leads by 12. And we'll be back with you for the start of the second quarter when we return. Well, not exactly a close game so far, but as the second quarter starts here, plenty of time for a comeback. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Los Angeles. Guys, their penetration has been outstanding. I mean, it's actually been great. They're really finding those holes in the defense. And the other thing, though, is their execution in terms of their ball movement has been flawless. Sets up a lot of easy scoring opportunities. Ande Dekumbo out there with Mark Gasol. Then there's Russell Westbrook. Then it's Thompson. And it's George in the three slot. And for Los Angeles, we've got Kevin Love. Michael Jordan is up there with Johnson. Then it's Worthy. And it's Walton in at the five down low. Westbrook with it. And it's Johnson picking him up. The three from George. Buries the long range jumper. George has got it back down to single digits for Anaheim. Johnson dishes to Worthy. Let's it go from 11. Anaheim grabs the miss. Outside for George. To the wing on the left. Here's Worthy. And he misses the fast break layup. If they could end every possession with that shot, they'd be happy. Nine times out of ten, that's an easy layup for them. Eastbrook wide open. He fires. And it's Westbrook again missing. Los Angeles leading by nine. Jordan kicks it over to Worthy. Unloads from 13. Count it. Good. Timeout, timeout. And he could be the guy to put this game out of reach. Yeah, that's a great call by you, Greg. You're right on top of it. He's a player that knows exactly how to seek out that jugular. And a new group getting ready for Anaheim. Ewing's checked in for Gasol. Butler comes in for George. Jones checked in for Thompson. And John Wall subbed in for Russell Westbrook. And then for Los Angeles, Shaq's checked in for Wall. Weber comes in for Kevin Love. And Larry Bird subbed for Worthy. Anaheim shooting their first free throws of this game. And so John Wall nails both of them. He's a dead eye at the line, fellas. Just call him automatic. He doesn't miss many of those. And Jones sends it back. They retain possession. I'm deep. The offensive rebound. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Tries again. The rebound by Johnson. 
to the paint. And Chris Weber with the bucket on the assist by Burr. Weber's got six. And an open path to the hoop there. Easy bucket. We've seen that far too many times today. Yeah, yeah, it's just been far too soft. Not much fight being shown by the defense there. And, boy, that's hard to watch, quite honestly. And so Butler nails both of them. And working, Kevin, themselves to the line here in the second. A nice way to get your offense going. And maybe cause some foul trouble along the way as well. And we know what that can do. It pays off typically in good fashion for you. Here's Johnson. And then Johnson with the dunk. And what a beautiful way to polish off that sequence. Just strong at attacking the rim. That just puts a little more momentum on their side, don't you think? Absolutely. The defense got to tighten up now. I mean, you can't have the opposing point guard throwing down on you like that. Weber gets going in. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. And really the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. It is. I mean, no reason to back off and give him the layup. I mean, much better off making him go to the line. And the whistle blows as the basket counts in a three-point play chance right here. One free throw coming up. You know, a huge height advantage there, but because of the great body control, he's able to cancel it out. Agreed. The body control essential in that situation. I mean, if you're giving up a bunch of height, then you better be able to manufacture things in the air. And very little fight put up by the defense as he made his way to the bucket for the chance. They did seem to take the cautious approach, Greg, when it came to defending that one. You're right. And guys, it's not the time for caution now. I mean, they've got to be aggressive and take some risk to see if they can cut that lead down. Oh, phenomenal alley-oop slam there. They are taking advantage of a team that looks lost out there. Boy, I tell you what, guys, this is really getting close to being real ugly. A slight rebound advantage for them. One more column in their favor, and it's all adding up. Well, you take a look at all of the stats, the team stats, that is, and that's one of the many areas that they've had the advantage. And as a result, they've got a big lead. He's gone two for two at the line so far. That free throw missing. So both teams changing it up here. Good on the second free throw. Yeah, a nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. My kind of hoop. Straight ahead, playing downhill and physical. Anaheim shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. First one falls for him. Anaheim making a switch here. Gasol's checked in. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Patrick Ewing's checked in for O'Neal. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Ewing. Buries the seven-footer. Ewing's got five. Another bucket down low. They've been the aggressors taking the ball inside and attacking at the rim. You're exactly right. It's been all good at one end, and let's be diplomatic and just say not so good at the other end. And as we welcome you back, we begin our second half. So far, not a tightly contested game, guys, but, you know, anything can happen. Chris Weber really making a difference here. And his play in that first half, how about the discipline to go along with the efficiency, guys? His shot selection was just perfect. I agree. I mean, whether it's been from mid-range or in tight, he is taking only what the defense has given him and not trying to do too much. Very much playing within himself. All out there with Jimmy Butler. And then there's Antetokounmpo. Then there's Ewing. And it's George in the small forward position. That's Steve Kerr's five as we get into the second half. Look at the turnover situation, guys. And it's not been that bad. Just a handful. And when you take care of the ball like that, that can help you build the lead. Major defensive laps right there. I mean, he's not a player you can leave open for a jump shot. You've got to stay attached to him. They're lucky he couldn't punish them for it. 
Yeah, enough scoring on the inside there. I think it's time for him to send a message to his team. Yeah, you're exactly right. I guarantee you this talk centers around cutting down on all of those points coming in the paint. They've got to show more resistance there. Anaheim trails by 13. And Wall kicks to Honda Tacumbo. And the slam dunk by Honda Tacumbo. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Well, I like the way he capped off that drive. The one hand hole punch. Three pointer. Butler drills the three pointer. Butler's got eight. And that's one of his strengths, knocking down those long-range jump shots. Jordan, the best to Abdul-Jabbar. And there's the call on Giannis Antetokounmpo. That's his third foul of the game. Stolen by Ewing. Boy, it seems like he's gotten a little loose with it since halftime. His fingers may be a little slick or slippery. He went from no turnovers in the first half to quite a few here in the second. This offense is first miss after three straight makes to start the second half. And out of bounds as Anaheim gains possession. Russell Westbrook's checked in for John Wall. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Worthy's checked in. Ewing. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact and he'll shoot two. For Anaheim, they shot six or seven at the line. Thompson, he's checked in for Anaheim. Both good from the line that time. We're seeing today what makes him one of the best free throw shooters among the league's big men. Beautiful stroke. Here's Shaq. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. He's made three of his four free throw attempts in the game. Russell Westbrook in for Magic Johnson. Both shots good from the strike. Anaheim trails by eight. Westbrook kicks to Ewing. Cool. Nice assist from Westbrook. He's got eight. How about this run there in the midst of on the verge of tying it up or maybe even taking the lead? It has been an unreal turnaround, and I give a lot of credit to the defense right along with what they did on offense because the defense actually gave them the spark they needed. And Los Angeles with some changes. Love comes in for Shaq. And it's Weber in for Abdul-Jabbar. Outstanding foul shooting in this game. And that confidence can be infectious. They're taking care of business on the charity strike. Here's Westbrook. They get it again. And stolen by Worthy. Pass to Weber. A good-looking shot from the wing. Timeout, timeout. Weber's got 10 points. Started. I mean, if you're looking to get back into this game, you have to get tougher defensively. Yeah, it looks like he saw some things out there that, that need to be adjusted, and it's going to take a break here and talk it over. Hey, you know, coaches sometimes need a break in the action to rethink and retool a bit. Anytime you, you're in that situation, it makes sense to use the timeout. Dwayne Wade's checked in to Los Angeles. Here's Francis. And another miss by Anaheim. The edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. And really a reflection of their superior effort level to this point. It seems to me they've gone after this win a little bit more. That one drops for him. And it's a 12-point Los Angeles lead. He has such a nice touch for a big man. Yeah, and they've got to figure out a way to get a bigger body on him because if they don't match up his size, then he's going to continue to work him over the rest of the game. That was a smart pass by Wade that time. Here's Gasol. He trains the turnaround jump shot. Gasol's got his first points in this one. Picture perfect with the turnaround. There's no stopping that shot. Boy, Kevin Love certainly is one of the best passing big men in the league. Anaheim trails by 14. Thompson dishes to George. And Gasol slams it in. Oh, up high and down hard with that one-hander. He got a little extra forceful. You're right with that one. 
Boy, that sounded like Greg. Whoa! Whoa. Hey, hey, hey! Woo. Watch out now! Watch out! He's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go, baby. It is showtime. And why not? A little salt in the wound. The more plays they make like that, the more they'll have these guys reeling and on the ropes. Marcus Gasol picks up the foul. Hey, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for Los Angeles? Boy, their passing has been picturesque, a thing of beauty in both halves. More than a few of their baskets have come off assists. Yeah, but they've also done a great job of playing in space, getting out in transition every opportunity. Here's what Anaheim's going with right now. Durant's checked in for Gasol. Hayward comes in for Jimmy Butler, and James Harden subbed in for Thompson. And it's Paul George with the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. For Los Angeles, they have shot 10 of 11 at the line. Nice work so far for them. Los Angeles making a switch here. Bird's checked in. They grab their own miss. The three from Harden. It's not going to go for him. Los Angeles leading by 15. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Wall. So that will be his second foul of the game. We're in the bonus, and we'll go to the line to shoot two. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line this half. 100% since halftime? Come on now. I'm not sure this lead's going away anytime soon with that kind of marksmanship. Wade kicks to Ewing. The shot's good on the assist by Wade. Wade's got three assists in the game. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness, Greg. I mean, if they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. That is just a careless turnover. You've got to be smarter in those exchanges. And they clearly are just destroying this group right now from the three-point line. Yeah, and the defense knows it. I mean, they are fully stretched out trying to stop the three-point shot and still haven't been able to do it. And here at the end of the... And we welcome you back as we get going here in the fourth quarter. The final quarter of play can change everything. Anaheim trails by 16. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the fourth quarter. Taking a look at Los Angeles. They've got LeBron James. Ewing is up there with Abdul-Jabbar. Then it's Johnson, and it's Jordan in at the two. He didn't get to that one quite in time, Kevin. Those can be tough to gauge sometimes. Kicks it out to James. Hits it from three-point range. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Well, when you look at the assist totals, Heck, they've been clearly the better team. And that's some inspiration. Steals, blocks, and a big dunk. Those are ways that you can really change the momentum in a game. Well, they got to chip away at that deficit, and no doubt that'll help. And that's what he's out there for, guys. I mean, he is an electrifying player, no doubt. And so Jordan nails both of them. Here's Francis. Outside Durant. And Anaheim with another three. Well, you've got to like the focus that they're showing here in the second half. I see a lot more effort as well. I mean, it's amazing when you lock in mentally and bring some energy and intensity, things can pick up in a positive way for you. Another shot. And it's Abdul-Jabbar getting it to go. And Los Angeles leads by 16. Timeout called Anaheim. Anaheim making a switch here. Butler's checked in. And it's Anaheim with the ball for three. No good that time. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. Guys, that's putting it mildly. I mean, they've been absolutely dominant. He hasn't really done much on the offensive end, but he's worked within the team concept to help them get the lead. He's done some other things 
other than scoring to help his team get the lead here. And Durant sends it back. Out to the right wing. Here's Francis. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. I'm not sure that was the play they had set up, but it was too good a look to pass him. Stolen by Durant. From the arc. And Anaheim with another three. Of all the guys you want to leave open out on the perimeter, he is the absolute last guy on the list. Attention to detail. Know your personnel. Here's Abdul Jabbar. And Kareem throws it down. And guys, he's not an easy man to stop when he's got the rim in his sights. Never has been, never will be. He is a determined finisher. And guys, I like the fact that he chose the one hand tomahawk slam because you get a little higher when you go off one hand and one foot. Clock at four. Anaheim needs to get off a shot here. From deep, Jordan. It's good from long range. Jordan's got five points in the quarter. And that's not the way for a team to get back into a game, giving up open shots like that. Yeah, I agree completely. I mean, there's no way to come back if they continue to allow him to knock down those bombs like that. Los Angeles calls timeout. Check in for Los Angeles. Russell Westbrook comes in for Magic Johnson. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Well, guys, during the last break, I listened to Greg Popovich talk to his team. It was pretty clear cut to them. He said, look, we need to play with some edge out there. I don't care what the lead is. Do not back off. And it's Butler missing. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. It's stolen by Wall. And then George with the jam! Oh, he is a highlight reel unto himself, guys. Uh, that could be a contender for the dunk of the year, I think. Without question, a crowd pleaser to the 10th degree. Bird. Westbrook passes to O'Neal. And three from Jordan. And again, Los Angeles with the triple. And if you thought this game was over already, you're probably right. <laughs> yeah, I would agree. I mean, it's staring us right in the face, and we've been around long enough to know when a game is over. And this one is in that category. Here's Abdul Jabbar. Again, Los Angeles. Is it getting dark in here? Because if not, it's time to turn the lights out. <laughs> They're out already. I mean, give them a ton of credit for the job they did here today. Really impressive. And George, here we go. Rebounded by Abdul Jabbar. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over him. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Throw good, Bird. Well, Larry Bird in this one, he has eight points, and from long range, he's hit one three-pointer. And when it's all said and done, I got a sneaky suspicion he's going to have a few more. And it's good for two. If you're waiting for him to miss when he's that open, you're going to be in for a long wait. Jordan kicks to Westbrook. And there's the pass to Bird. Takes the 13-footer, and the basket good. A bank shot that time. And Los Angeles leads by 19. Outside Butler. His three-pointers off the mark. Shaq kicks to Bird. The first one falls. Bird hits them both. Harden outside. Missed. So it's Los Angeles winning this one easily. This crowd was stunned. By 